Right guys, so before we get started, basically what I want you to do is leave me some comments down below um, for a Q&A, the 28k Q&A. When I'm recording this video, I've not hit 28k yet, but we're very close, so when it's out, we probably will have. Um, so yeah, just leave me some questions for the Q&A, because on Friday I'm going to Spain, so um, I won't really have that many videos out, but this one will be out when um, I go away. So yeah, but when I'm back, I will be doing the every two day uploads. So yeah, that's about it. Just make sure you leave me some questions down below for the 28k Q&A and yeah let's just get straight back into it. Yo guys what is going on Tim here welcome back to another video on the channel so in today's video I'll be teaching you guys how I stream onto YouTube so I'll just be showing you guys just the settings I use what software and the, the designs the graphics that I actually use within the streams and yeah it's gonna be really easy I know a lot of you guys have been asking me how I do this and you want this you've been wanting this video for quite a while so I'll show you guys how to do that today. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, smash that like button. Can we break 250 likes on this video? That would be amazing. Subscribe if you are new, and let me know what video would you like to see from me next in the comments down below. And yeah, let's get straight into it. Right guys, so um, this is OBS right here. So for people who don't know, this is what it looks like. Um, you've got start, a streaming, recording, you've got the settings over there. You've got your desktop and mic, and then this is basically all the things that are on the screen right now. And then you've got different scenes, so this is just one scene, and then you can add a new one, a new scene, and add all different other things to it. Um, but yeah, the first I'm going to show you guys is just how to connect it up to your YouTube channel. So you want to go to settings, stream, and then choose service, which is YouTube, or you can choose anything else like Twitch. And then the stream key is basically to get that, you just want to go to your YouTube channel, go to live stream in the settings, and then it'll bring you to the live streaming page and you just want to scroll down and copy the stream key, paste it here and then that'll be that and you're connected. So once you press the stream, start streaming, it'll just start streaming for you guys. Um, and then the audio and video, you can get just mess with that yourself. So if you've got a mic, you can put it in there, the size of the screen and stuff like that. Everything else should be fine. Now to get the things actually on here, like the sub count, the donations and the overlay that's pretty simple so for the overlay all you want to do is um, over here what you want to do is just press this button here and you've got all these different menus and you, want to, you just want to choose image and then probably just call that overlay and then press ok oh it's already in use so I'll just put overlay 2 and then you want to browse and you basically just need to search for your overlay and then that's that and then your overlay will pop up like right here I've got mine. Um, so the next thing, I'm going to show you guys how to add the alerts for subscribers and donations. So what you want to do is go over to Streamlabs. So if you don't have Streamlabs, make sure you go get it and make an account. And here you can add like alerts and stuff for when people subscribe. So down here at alert box, you just want to um, basically just come over to this. And you can edit the donation, subscribers, sponsors, all the different things. So the layout, the image that pops up, the sound that pops up, and everything like that. And then once you've done that, you just want to copy this widget URL um, and then bring it over to Streamlabs. So you just want, uh, not Streamlabs, to OBS. So to actually get them, you just want to press the plus button, go to browser source, call it alerts, and then you just type in the um, URL that we just copied and it'll be onto, onto this. But I'm just gonna delete that. So yeah, you just wanna paste it into browser source, that link right there, and then you'll have alerts in your videos. Um, now I'll show you guys how to add the donation goal. I've just recently added this, so yeah. Um, you wanna go to goals, which is right there donation goal and you can add a subscriber goal as well and then for this you just want to um, do the settings and stuff so the title the goal the days remaining and then you can edit the colors and everything like that and the size and then to get this into your stream you just want to copy the URL over there go to OBS press plus browser source and then um, call it goals and then you just want to paste the URL into there and then it will be done and it will be into your stream. So that's donation goal, the overlay done, 
the alerts done. And now, what else can I show you? Oh yeah, I've also got the uh, sub count up at the top. So to get the sub count, all you want to do is um, go to livecounts.net, type in your name, so for me it's Timpers, and you just want to copy the URL and go back to OBS, go to the plus sign, browser source, um, sub count, and then you just want to paste it in there. And then you just want to make sure the size. Um, I'll just show you guys. Let me just go to mine. It's got to be a certain size so that it's just the text right there. So, yeah, the size needs to be 800 by 600. And you need to type this in to the CSS make sure that's typed in so make sure you just pause the video right now and type that in and that basically removes the background so yeah just type that into the thing and that's the sub count done so the overlay done sub count donation goals alerts and yeah that's about it guys for all the different things that i have on my streams so yeah um if you guys want me to do a pack, like a stream pack, where I've got um, overlays in there and um, yeah, just like, an, like all different types of overlays, I might do that for when I hit 28k, I'm not too sure yet, but yeah, um, if you don't know already, I do stream quite often, so if you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications. And yeah, that is about it for the video. I hope you did enjoy. Smash the like button. Can we break 250 likes on this video? That would be sick. Subscribe if you are new. We are very, very, very close to 28k now. Um, comment down below what video you'd like to see from me next. And also leave some questions for the 28k Q and A, which will be coming up very soon. Um, and yeah, hope you're all having a sick day today. I'll see you guys in the next video.